Hey, it's Matt Gomez from Acromedia, and today we're talking checkout functionality. So a uh, recent survey stated that 30% of online retailers have poor checkout functionality. So what does that mean exactly? Well, firstly, it's really concerning. Um, you guys typically invest a ton of money, a um, ton of time in trying to get people to look at your products, find your site, actually you know, want to buy your products, add them to a cart, they get to checkout, and you see abandonment rates. So there's some pretty simple things that you can do to try and improve abandonment rates uh, uh, and functionality. Um, real little tweaks that are really helpful. So one of the big ones is shipping costs. It's one of the biggest causes of car abandonment. So try and get that out of the way early in your checkout flow. Uh, if you have free shipping promotions, make sure you're telling people how much extra they need to spend to reach the threshold. Um, allow them to calculate their shipping, ideally on product pages, but at least in the first sequence of the, the checkout functionality. Um, little things like autofill, super helpful. Um, if you have any account information on file for that particular purchaser, make sure you're pulling that in so they have less to complete. If you're a coupon-based uh, company where you're offering lots of discounts and different um, you know, coupons and promos and all of that sort of stuff, have a really clear way for them to either be able to redeem those, add those, or automatically do it for them and make them aware of it. Um, you know, even little things like, you know, people use carts in different ways. They use them to uh, collate things that they're looking to potentially buy, but they're gonna come back to later. So even the option to check out now or to keep shopping and to bring them back to where they were. There's lots of little tweaks that can be done to improve checkout functionality. But remember, you know, really look into your, how you're doing it because you've gone to all that effort to a get them to your site um, you've then gone through the effort of taking them through some good ui be able to find the products serving them products they need getting them to a point where they add them to cart it's the worst place to lose them um, because you kind of have got them at that point not in every case a lot of people use carts just to kind of collate wish lists um, but man you're close so if you want to chat about car experience, give us a shout. Uh, if you've got any kind of insights that you want to share or any wins that you had from little tweaks, put them in the comments also. All right, take care. Bye-bye.